Hello everyone, welcome back to day 76 of Stardew Valley. Uh, I've just been yawning constantly the past like mm, two hours, so yeah, you, you could say that I'm a little bit tired. Like, just before I started recording, or more like before the game finished loading, I just Oh, had a really big yawn and there are actually tears in my eyes right now so uh, yeah if I uh, have to yawn again please excuse me it's not like I'm really tired or something like I slept pretty well last night I even had a sleepover which is always super great because I love having sleepovers I guess, but I think that is one of the things that many people like, you know, just hanging out with a friend until you both, you're both like, hey, maybe we should get some sleep, and then you just wake up at like 12 because you both aren't sure whether you should wake up the other person or not, so you just go back to sleep until the other person is maybe awake at the same time as you. I mean, that's at least uh, how my sleepovers go most of the time. Although it didn't really go like that today. Like, I didn't really feel like sleeping uh, for much longer, so I just decided to stay awake. So, yeah, I only had to, to wait for like one hour until the other person was awake, which is not that long, so yeah, that was pretty alright. I, I want more, no. Well, okay, screw it. So yeah, but I mainly had a sleepover because they live pretty far away and we both wanted to see Kingsman, although they had already seen it once but they really wanted to see it with me as well and I also wanted to see it as well so yeah but uh, yeah it was a nice movie I enjoyed it a lot like there was this character w without really spoiling the movie I hope and they were also in the last movie but they came off more as like a joke if anything which could be multiple characters i think but they returned in this movie in a more serious way and also i guess some characters got sort of killed off i guess but that's just like whoa they're out for kingsman as you could have seen in the trailer but nothing really really that much i guess I, I i should stop talking about it maybe before i spoil anything more about the movie because i wouldn't want to ruin it for anyone who's, who still has to go and see it because i really enjoyed it and speaking about movies I also got asked during the sleepover like what my favorite movie is and I have to say I had a hard time deciding on what my favorite movie is like I have a lot of movies that I enjoy and that I could just see over and over and over without getting bored but I don't know I, I just don't think I could pick a favorite like I, I could say Brother Beer is my favorite because I I liked that movie a lot and the animation was great and also the storyline I liked it a lot but I don't know favorite is just such such a big word like I don't even think I can pick a favorite book so yeah like i also love the third pokemon movie mainly because i just watched that one a lot when i was like 
12 years and under. But... Oh shit, they can see me, huh? But I wouldn't just call it my favorite movie ever. Just as with The Lion King 2, actually, which I also saw a lot when I was small, I guess. But yeah, it's, it's just weird like that. Like, I also love Mamma Mia the movie a lot. Although that's also partially because I really like ABBA songs. Not in a way of I just of me going out of my way to listen to them, but in a way of they're fun to sing along, I guess. If that makes sense, I think it does. But yeah, I don't know, there are just a lot of movies which I think are pretty good, but I would not consider them my favorite movie because there are just so many movies that I enjoy. And really, there are lots of movies that I enjoy. Like, I just like sitting on the couch at night and watching a movie together with my mom and just really zoning out a bit, maybe browsing stuff on my phone. Yeah, just... oh. Oh, hey, guess I found the meteorite, huh? But yeah, just zoning out a bit and chilling on the couch and de-stressing a bit. And sometimes there are just really bad movies on TV, but that's, that's alright. I mean, I can turn it off if I want. Like, I don't really have Netflix because I don't really want to pay extra I guess to see a movie on demand but with watching TV it's just a surprise will there be a good movie on TV tonight will there be something that makes me cry because of how bad it is who knows not me although yeah maybe me because we also get a television guide which usually says what kind of movies we can expect to see in the upcoming, like, week, I guess. But except for that, it's just a surprise. Usually a pleasant surprise. And sometimes you also have traders on TV, where they're like, Whoa, go watch this movie next week. And that's cool too, because it's like, Whoa, this cool movie is is on the television um, next Monday and I'm going to see that maybe or I can um, ask someone if they want to see it with me and I realized that saying stuff like this sounds outdated since we have Netflix and Hulu or whatever but yeah I enjoy just watching stuff that's on TV the only reason when I don't like it is when there's movies like Fifty Shades of Grey on TV and it is apparently on TV next Monday and I know that because there have been trailers for it, for it and they started showing the trailer for it since like a week ago so for one week straight I have been tortured by being forced to watch Fifty Shades of Grey teasers or trailers or whatever during the commercial breaks like normally I'm not really bothered by commercial breaks because I'm the kind of person that actually does need to go to the toilet two or three times during a movie but when it's stuff like that, it's like, I don't, I don't want to see that on TV. Not even the commercial, like, please keep that stuff away from me. Thank you very much. So, yeah. But I don't know, a lot of people seem to be complaining about commercial breaks and 
they sometimes even when they do watch regular television they just start watching it on a later uh, time just so they can skip through the commercial breaks but yeah it just doesn't bother me no matter how bad the commercials are because sometimes there's just a commercial that's all right i guess i mean i can recall that there was one i think that i've been enjoying lately but i don't even remember which one if i'm completely honest hmm but that doesn't matter anyway anyway because saying whoa i like this brand's commercial whoa sounds a, a bit like a commercial on its own i think so let's not do that whoa has it been 10 minutes already yeah i think so huh let's get uh, these eggs in the uh, chicken things mayonnaise machines yeah those things okay then i am actually just really tired even though i did sleep well so i guess i'm just going to make this one a pretty short episode so uh yeah let's see what kind of weather we are getting tomorrow uh rain again oh in real life that's also been raining all day and mm, not really making me very happy like i don't dislike rain but it's more the gray skies that go with it that i dislike anyway thanks for watching today's episode i hope you had a nice day and that your weekend so far is being just great overall i guess yeah so um good night <laughs>